hey everybody welcome back to my channel thank you guys for the people that have started to watch me and look out for my videos and i would definitely want more people to watch and look out for my videos because i'm truly having a lot of fun making these so i'm gonna do another ship with me video i was gonna do a thread up unboxing but i'm just now getting my voice back so i wanted to get back a little bit better before i actually do a um a thread up unboxing um, but I'm going to do a quick ship with me video. This one is going to be weird because I did print out shipping labels, but to be honest with you, my printer has been acting up a little bit. So before I actually put the label on the box, I just want to double check to make sure I'm sending it to the right people. So my plan is just to kind of put it in the package, show what I'm shipping. And then before I actually seal it up completely, I need to go back and double check the label, but I'm going to do all that off camera. Um, quick introduction. Hi, my name is Sheree. I recently went from working at home to now working uh, in an office environment. So I've been focusing now more on doing more, um, sh uh, uh, more selling, reselling, as far as selling on Poshmark and Macari and getting into thrifting. Um, right now I do all of my um, stuff through ThreadUp because I'm not going into any thrift stores or anything like that. Everything that I'm doing is through just getting my items off of ThreadUp to resell. So that's where the majority of my merchandise comes from. If not, it's out of my closet or I do tend to sell things that are given to me from like my family members, like my sister and my mom, if I go through their closet. But like I said, because this is going to be a little bit of a wonky ship with me, I'm going to start, which I think I'm going to try to start doing now if I can do it. I ordered something off of Poshmark. I wish I could tell you guys where I got it from, but I'm using my camera to film this evening and not the laptop. So we're going to try to figure this out the best that we can. Um, I will put it in the description box below um, the Poshmark seller that I got this from. That's why when I'm able to get to my phone, I'll just put it in the description box. So, this is my box. I ordered it from Poshmark. It's supposed to be like a sweater that I want to wear over like a button-down type shirt. So, she sent it to me in a regular little box. Um, and here it is right here. She just had this sweater in there. It's a Hollister. Oh, it's going to be cute because I got me some blue pants. I'm going to wear this tomorrow. And a cute little shirt but just came in a box and here's the item like i said it's just a hollister uh vest all right so that's what i got for myself so let's go into what i'm actually shipping out right now today all right so first is going to be this Mar marla maples two-piece bathing suit i bought this years ago when i went to la um at it's called maples the maples top and bottom in the suit um just real high-waisted and then a um lace up back but i bought this years ago like right after nipsey hutzel died we went to la not planning to go for that but we had already planned a trip and we just happened to get there after but i got it at hollywood Fergus of hollywood whatever that store is called whatever the lingerie store is called but i've had it for about two years so I put it in just this Ziploc baggie just because it's two pieces and I want them to stay together. And then I'm just going to fold it up and my duck wrapping paper. And then for my tape but I don't know where that could have gone off to so we can do it like this and do it like this and I have a thank you sticker every time I go to film these videos something always seems to go wrong like I've never had everything that I need to do this it drives me nuts mm. but then like I said you guys get the real deal no filters, no nothing. Because like, everything I need is always here. Now I want to just put this in at the same time. Filter. Alright, so like I said, I'm not going to actually put the labels on these until I can actually match it. So 
I'm just gonna write bathing suit right here. And then when I get the label, I will do the right thing. Um, the next things are gonna be these petty pad little toddler shoes. I got these out of a children's thread up box that I ordered. And again, due to the fact that I just can't seem to find the shipping materials that I need today, I'm just going to put them in a self sealing box. The box is too big for this item, but I have some thread up paper. <laughs> Thank you, polka dot paper. I'm gonna wrap my these little children's shoes up. Mm -hmm. Like so, like just like that. Put a little thank you sticker on it. All these items sold on Poshmark, so at least the shipping will be easy. I just fold them up like this. Put them in the box. up and then like I said I'm just gonna write what is in the box also I forgot to write label right, the next thing that's gonna go are these Adriana Goldsmead um these were the Telus modern slim jeans that came out of my last denim box that I got from thread up And because again, I don't know where my tape is, I'm just gonna use some got some Christmas tissue paper. I'm gonna just wrap them up in that, put a pencil stick on it, and put them in self so Like Making this easy on me today. Put those pink stickers right there. Oh, I don't want the big one. Do I got a little one? Hold on. next thing up is going to be these Mandy. They were John Galt um, corduroy overalls. But I listed them as Brandy Melville overalls. I don't know if you guys can even see them. They have like a flared leg to them. And these were a size small. That's what it said. It said small. So and these also sold on Poshmark. And I haven't even had these listed. Not even two weeks, I don't think. Maybe a week. I got the box like last week. So I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to wrap them in just some regular tissue paper. And put a thank you sticker on it. And put them in, a big bo in this big box over there right next to me. Since I don't have any tape to really put my arm um, right there into the duck bag. Thank you, sticker on
I know this is not the best packing game, and I'm so, so sorry. I just don't know where anything is. And it's kind of too late to go find more stuff. I apologize in advance. the quickest I've ever done this maybe because I don't have what I need all right so next is this gold sequin it had like plastic on the inside it did have a stain I did disclose it I had bought this for myself I think I was gonna wear it somebody was having some type of gathering or a party and I said I was gonna use it and wear it but when I got it home, I realized that the chain was broke, and I tried to fix it, and yeah, it just didn't work out for me. So I relisted it on Posh, and somebody purchased it. I did disclose that the chain is broke, so hopefully, and I took pictures, so hopefully there should be no issues there. I did tell people that it was broke. to pack but I guess because in my mind I did this is Christopher and Banks extra large cardigan open light sweater this came in a 50 piece mix box from thread up and I sold it on Poshmark done one one two three four five six packages all going out today well tomorrow when my daughter gets off the school I'll make her drop them off for me but like I said I just wanted to make it short and sweet it was a little bit easier because again I gotta go back I like I said I did print the labels I just need to confirm everything goes to the right label um don't forget to like and subscribe come back like I said I'm gonna have a thread up DIY t-shirt unboxing next um and just guys come back and watch me make mistakes because I do it all the time but enjoy the rest of your evening see you guys next time